welcome back to our show, your show, Let's Talk Stocks. Joining us in studio this morning to continue our conversation on the importance of managing your environmental properly is Ruth Potapsing, Technical Advisor at Environmental Solutions. Welcome, Ruth. We, 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 we've been talking about global warming and climate change. Um, what really is its impact on businesses in a, in, in a, in a real way? Um, how do businesses benefit from being conscious of, of these type of activities? Well, that's a very easy question ah. to answer. <laughs> <laughs> because if you practice good environmental um, practices, mm -hmm. <laughs> then you are going to see the benefits. Mm -hmm. Take, for instance, your electricity. Uh -huh. If you are um, using the right equipment, your inverter, air conditioning systems, your solar powered um, lighting or your cooling, it's going to be to your benefit. Yes. You are not only reducing your carbon output or your carbon footprint mm -hmm. and helping globally to reduce the heat mm -hmm. that, is, that we are now experiencing through climate change. If each business does their part, then you're going to find that cumulatively we will have a better environment. Mm -hmm. Cumulatively, we see the impacts of climate change. We have floods, we have droughts. For a business, if you do not take care of the environment, if you do not have practices that um, manage your soils, manage your water, your water consumption, and droughts come on, then you're not able to say you're in agriculture. How will you produce? The other thing is that when there are floods and tsunamis and other events, weather events, internationally, they disrupt your supply chain. Mm -hmm. And so you are impacted. So it is everybody's business to practice good environmental management. Mm -hmm. Some of those things you, you, you touched on just now, people will tell you oh, that's the government. Um, that's the government should, should take care of those things. Why should I be focused not on driving additional profits from my company? Um, the government should spend money to ensure that the you know, structures are put in place, the, the amenities are put in place that is friendly to the environment. Well, government has an important role to play in putting in the infrastructure and making the infrastructure available. Mm -hmm. But how we use the, in, that infrastructure mm -hmm. in our business is what is key because okay. the government will put in the water supplies. Mm -hmm. But if you do not manage your, the water that is coming to you, then how are you going to manage in times of drought? Mm -hmm. How are you going to cope with um, lack of electricity? Mm -hmm. when we are not practicing good um, energy management? How are we going to um, benefit if we um, wantonly, if the public wantonly mm -hmm. throws garbage, plastic bottles and all types of debris oh. in the drains? You will notice that you may just have 20 minutes of a shower, of a heavy downpour, and the roads are flooded. How does that impact mm -hmm. your business? It can cause mm -hmm. the, um, damage to your mm -hmm. infrastructure. It mm -hmm. uh, impacts your workers and mm -hmm. the general movement of persons. So mm -hmm. while government has an important role to play in providing mm -hmm. the infrastructure, it is our business, everyone's mm -hmm. business, to make sure that we play our part in using those facilities mm -hmm. wisely and um, in a sound way. Interestingly, Ruth, um, as, 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 I say, as you talk about the globe becoming smaller, um, certainly the resources for, for small island states like ours, while there's benefit to be had, the resources to put in place some of these um, environment best practices are, are just not there. How do we deal with that? Well, there's a great big area called resource efficiency. Mm -hmm. We have limited resources. So even if we are a small island state, 
or a continent, we have to manage our resources in a manner that speaks to sustainability. Sustainability requires that we are not just considering the Im immediacy of profits or the immediacy of doing a particular action, but looking beyond. Mm -hmm. Say, for instance, mining. If we um, degrade our land resources and do not restore them in a proper way, it has a lot of okay. downside effects. Mm -hmm. You know, So while you may benefit from the the minerals that we're extracting, if it is not extracted in an environmentally sound manner, mm -hmm. financially it's going to cost you down the road. Mm -hmm. You have to have these practices up front mm -hmm. before you even put in what, uh, before you break the ground to do your, 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 mm -hmm. to, to your construction, we need to put in place the plans of how we are going to manage our environment. Mm -hmm. And as we look to wrap, what's the final word you'd want to leave in the minds of our viewers? Importance of environment to businesses. Well, businesses must engage in best environmental practices because it is to your benefit. Mm -hmm. um, you will profit by, by seeing the benefits of um, proper use of your water, your electricity, mm -hmm. and of your human resources. Oh. And good corporate social responsibility is important. It's mm -hmm. a win-win for all. We have a responsibility mm -hmm. as citizens, as businesses, mm -hmm. to look into what is happening now and the future to know that we are not going to get investors mm -hmm. from our Gen Z or mm -hmm. our alpha oh. generation <laughs> if we continue to disregard sound environmental management and practices. Well said. Couldn't have said it better. And that's why we do this program. You heard it. We'll not get the money from the young investors to grow the business profitably and sustainably unless we practice sustainable environmental practices. That's why we do this show. That's why day after day we tell you, we give you information to make better financial decisions. Come back with us tomorrow morning at 9, another insightful program lined up for you.